is up you guys so today I am gonna do a video about the two shelves behind me right now so these are all for these little guys this one and my other one that's outside the door but these little guys are the most oh, I didn't actually throw her I threw her onto a beanbag chair she's fine <laughs> um, so this whole thing is for like my cats I've had cats since two or three years ago. I've had my fat one, Molly. Um, she's right here if you guys want to see. She's, she's, she's right there. <laughs> she's kind of annoy ignoring me right now. But though, that's my cats. So, hold on, you don't need to see my boobs. What you guys need to see are my supplies. So, let me bring it all a little bit closer. So, this is all of the stuff I have for right now. Might get more, don't know. So, in this huge container right here is just dry food that I use for um, weight control for Molly because she's a little bit overweight. So, we just wanted to make that better, I guess, for her. Um, so then these are just treats that Molly likes when I need to get her into the room. These are Gravylicious Party Mix treats. None of this is sponsored, obviously. So that's what they look like. These are one of her favorites. She's already coming. She's literally like right by my feet right now. You wanna see her? She's right, right there. Hi. You want some, baby? I'll show you how much she loves them. She goes nuts over them. She absolutely loves them. She's actually moving the camera right now. Come here. Oh, the other one wants one. Hold on. Hey. Alright. So, that is these types of treats. I do have so many treats because when I first got them I was addicted to giving them treats for some reason I don't know that's probably why she's a little bit overweight but we'll see through that so the next thing is I have back here is a another tub of Arm & Hammer double duty litter detor detergent and I just use this for their litter boxes when I clean them out these are just this is a dirty top that I never use, so don't don't think about that. And then this is a dirty bowl that I never use either. It was an old bowl, and I don't use it. Um, right in a bag. I think that was with catnip in it. So then we have two different types of things, which is whiskeys, pure, perfectly perfect chicken entree. That's what they look like, if you guys can see. And then this purely fancy feast filet um, tuna and chicken. So they really like those. So the one who usually drinks or eats the like the liquid and like the the wet food is Bella, which is the smaller one, which is she's laying over there. But I'll get her later. The one I was holding before she likes the wet food most but Molly has seemed to start liking it sorry my cat's moving the camera but she seemed to start liking it which I don't really get but you know so Molly likes drinking this which is just cat sip that's lactose free because she is a very lactose intolerant she will spit it up automatically so you know that's good <laughs> so all of these cans right here are just different types of fancy feast that I give like I give them tw two times a day like one in the morning one at night like dinner and breakfast and then up here is a huge tub of treats now some of them are dog treats just because they're fat and they like dog treats don't know why don't really care but this is sausages they don't really eat this that much anymore but they're cheese and beef flavored 
Next one is backcountry freeze-dried raw treats in raw salmon. Or salmon, not raw, but you get what I mean. Um, freeze-dried rabbit. Isn't that yummy? Mm. Um, the next one is my friend gave me this huge bag of 25 ounce bacon flavored treats. They don't really eat it. Usually they don't. Um, they have to be in the mood. I got these for free. I don't really know where. I think, actually, I think it was like a dollar or something. I got these minty dental treats. I should give them more often. I'll probably give them some today. And then the last thing in this container is the mixture of raw, or mixture of freeze-dried treats, or freeze-dried food. You can probably give it to them as food. I don't know. I don't give it to them as food though. I just give it to them as like toppers like that. Um, this is just chicken. So that's all that is in that container. Oh, the cat fell. I got this container at the dollar store. Isn't it lovely? It's just so lovely. I don't know. So there are treats back there, but like you need to see those. Those are just gross and they don't eat them and I don't really know why I have them still. So these are just rest of these um, chicken hearts. They're like running for these for some reason. They love these. Um, I'll just drop this. This is what they look like. They're kind of gross, but I call it Hunger Games depending on who gets it first. Is that probably messed up? Oh well. I have a tag had a tag. Throw that away. <laughs> so the two next things are these hand served chicken treats and chicken tuna salmon treats. That's what they look like. These are so expensive. I don't usually give it to them. I don't know if this is supposed to be refrigerated. Is it? I don't know. Oh, store in a cool dry place. I guess no. I don't know. They look like real chickens, so I mean, I probably should, but I'm not. Um, I don't give them to them that often, but I will. Um, and then back here are some really old, just like kibble treats that they like. They look like this. They were on sale, so I just got like a whole bunch of them. But they like these. They're kind of right. And then. These two things are flavored salmon sticks. Um, they're meaty, tender salmon sticks. Five sticks in a pack. They're like a dollar. I would recommend these. I don't really use them, give them to them that much. I usually just give them like regular, like dry, uh, dry and wet food. Don't really give them treats that much anymore, but I do, depending on how they are. People are probably gonna yell at me for this, but I have a can of spray cheese because they love cheese. Um, I probably should throw this away sooner or later. I haven't given it to them recently, so we're good. <laughs> um, and there's one more back there that's chicken, but I have two other things of wet food. She doesn't really like these because she throws up sometimes when she eats them, so I don't really give it to her. So the next two treats is these kitty treats that salmon and cranberry mix. I have that one. Then I have this hairball treat plus. They're soft. They're supposed to help. I'll probably give one each right now since. Why not? Oh, that was a lot. They're little hearts too. I'll show you in a minute. Hold on. One for you and one for you. They're little hearts though and they're really freaking cute. You guys can see the little heart. It's very cute. It's very chewy, which they have a problem with, but they usually get through it. Um, I have two hairbrushes. This one's like literally full of hair right now. I don't really know why. I think I think my friend was brushing her and she forgot to remove the hair. Um, I have a harness and a leash. I don't know. I thought I was going to bring them outside one day. Bad idea, guys. <laughs> they didn't get away from me. They just don't like being outside and everything. 
So then I have just a roll of um, paper, towel, just in case it's like they throw up or something. And I need to get more, obviously. And then these are just a whole bunch of toys, like little ones that rattle. She went straight for it. Um, this one's just like a huge one with a big tail. This one twerk, twerk, like tweets, tweets. She doesn't really like that one. <laughs> um, and then this one is like a compacted rat that has catnip on it. They have many, I don't know why. And then this one's just really stuffed animal. There's crinkly ones. I don't really give them crinkly ones because they're very annoying. Um, and then up here I have like rope ones. My friend got me this one that's like a little fishing rod. Like you like do that and it, let's go. She likes playing with it. I'll play with that with at the end and you'll see her play. So that's pretty much much it up here. Um, there is litter at the bottom, but I can't really carry that because my back is like killing me right now. But I will record her play for a little bit. supposed to be playing like a cat and not like a dog. <laughs> You're just kind of sitting there. Um, I love you guys so much and I hope you guys like this video. Comment down below what you guys want to see next or just leave something nice down below. So thank you guys so much and I love you guys. Bye!